previously on he was yeah kid uh office the officer has some business to do so you want my help for some multiverse stuff yes sir I do man uh, Ruthless, what are you doing here? Whoa! Well, Alan, you must use your legs instead of your feet to at least defeat villains. Because if you keep using your arms, they're gonna break. Oh, uh, hey, Alan. There is some bad news about you, somebody that you know, but... Probably best that the principal tells you when you go see him on Friday. Yeah, Alan, there is some bad news. But the principal, Mr. S, will tell you on uh, Friday. I'll also be here. But there is some good news, though. That you'll be living with me for now on. That's the good news. But I'll remind you on uh, the meeting on Friday at 3.30 or 3.30 to 4. It might take a while to get to the school since it's on the other side of the town. But you'll get there on time. I, I know you can. Hey, buddy. Uh, uh, the bad news is that your mother is dead. Oh, what? My mother is d dead? She can't be. But I'm the person that's supposed to put everybody in safety since I have that uh, super power strength, whatever it's called. Hey, m m mother. S sorry, guy. I d didn't put, put that put that to you when you were needed by that one villain. But that was I was here, so I can put put that to you. But I will get that villain for you, mom. I will. I will get revenge for you, no matter if, if it's that life or death, death, but I will defeat that villain for you, for you, 
I will be for that villain for you. Hey, hey, Alan. Uh, I saw that you needed me. Need needed me to be here for you. Oh, uh, hey, P Peter. I guess you know. The whole thing got gone now anyways. Uh, my mother is gone and now I'm depressed and everything. So, yeah. My mother is dead. I wish I could have just saved her. But I couldn't. But I'm the hero that pulled to save everybody. Even my closest friends like you, Jacob Boothless. Owen and Dr. Thunderlight. But I just couldn't because I'm not a hero. Hey man, don't say that. Like, like we more when you save me and the other two from that one villain, like a few weeks ago, like, like, dude, like, dude, you saved me and the other two from that villain, like, dude, you are a hero in some way, like, some things are, un are really unexpected. Dude, no matter how things go, dude. Doesn't matter how things go, man. Still not a hero. No matter if somebody's close to me or not, I'm still not a hero, man. Like, I'm going to save everybody with a smile. I want to be just like how Dr. Thunderlight was when he was the number one hero at, like, about 10 years ago. But. I can't do that, dude. Like, <coughs> but I'm not him, dude. But still, I want to be just like him. Listen, man. Listen, man. Some things are really unexpected in life. Like, look, it doesn't matter how, if you're the number one hero or any of that stuff, it doesn't matter really. Wait, look, it doesn't matter how far you go in life, things are still going to be unexpected. The future past, present, still doesn't matter, like, doesn't matter if you can change or not, you can't change, you can't change stuff that you can't want, what I mean by that, I mean like, you can't go back into the past and change the future because that doesn't work like that, I would come in, but it's like the flash. Like, I know that for a fact, dude. So, dude. Since we were kids, I knew you always wanted to be a hero. So, I know that. I know some things are gonna be hard, man. But look, we had to keep on going in life. Doesn't matter. Like, look, I lost my cousin, man. When I was younger. I never really knew him. So I had to move on. Yes, I know it's hard, man. So, well, from what I heard, my cousin is dead, but 
might still be out there. So, I have to keep on going, man. I have to. So do you. Well, I will try to move on, and I never really knew my dad, really, because from what I heard, he always worked in the army over, over on the other side of the planet, so he might be either missing, dead, or still working in the army, I'm not sure, but I will try to move on from my mother's death. Ah, uh, okay, good, dude. Well, we do have to go and meet up with Dr. Sunderlight and the others because of our big present, I guess I would say, for all of us surviving at least, at least, like, hey, <laughs> but let's go and get whatever we need, okay, dude, I need talking to anybody, let me know, dude, okay. Uh, okay, I will, Peter. Let's, let's go. Oh, hey, uh, hey, dude, uh, you said you needed me for some kind of universe type thing, because I found one person, but not the other, so, uh, you needed me, Philip. Uh, yes, I have. Uh, I have gotten a sign that that the universe, the multiverse is starting to be opened little by little from what we have been doing and researching about. So, by the time that Ellen and the other kids are done with their nuts. Ow. Sorry, I bit my tongue. But by the time they fight their nuts, big bad or villain, that the multiverse would be opened. Oh, really? Uh, well, well, is there any news about any villains out there yet? Because if so, I want to know, like, what's up with the villains? Oh, uh, well, there's one new villain called Seth. And his gang was been like been attack attacking the town, but this is not the town they've been attacking. They have been attacking other towns around here. In like a circle, you know, outside that circle and more. So if they come in this town it's a lot down then because Seth's powers, like, for what I've seen on cameras, and 
cameras and stuff, that Seth's power is really effective to human life. Which I mean by that, that his power could literally destroy anyone and anything. So we had to go and lock down if it get worse than just that couple of few towns or more. Because we don't want him near Alan or the kids of this town. So, but, <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> that, <coughs> oh, that, all the heroes, that, the older heroes have to at least protect anybody from that villain and that team before they get here. Which I think they might be here about as soon as possible. So hopefully it won't be here. Hopefully there will be won't. Then I have to be part of that because of my power. Well, hopefully they won't be here anytime soon. Because if so, then hopefully I can help in some way and form. So. Well, we probably won't need your help if not possible, but. We can possibly fit you into that since you don't have powers. You're only an op uh, officer, so you can probably lock down the other, or lock, not lock down, lock up the other ones. Not the, not like Seth, because we can probably try to help Seth out. So, yeah, that's about it, dude. Okay, well, I'm gonna go so I can get back to helping this case and out with the other people. So, I think that's about it. If so, give me a text or shoot me up. So I can know what's gonna happen with the monkey first and stuff. Oh, okay, dude, dude, I, I will. Okay, see you, be safe on your way back. Bye. Well, here we are at Patrick Thunder Lake's house. Well, he told me to get that we can get inside or before anything happens. So just let's get inside out, Alan. Oh, oh, okay. Let's send, head inside, Peter. Oh, uh, hey, Peter and Alan, you're finally here to get your costumes, or your hero costumes, of course, on. So, are you guys ready?
Oh, hey, Dr. Thunderlight. Oh, uh, uh, I didn't know we were getting our hero costumes today, actually. And, uh, I didn't know we were supposed to be here for that, exactly. Oh, hey, Alan. Uh, yeah, you're here for the hero costumes today, anyways. And, uh, I'm sorry about what happened with your mother. I don't understand how you feel, man. Uh, I know Peter lost his cousin, like, a while ago. Yeah, uh, I already know that Peter's cousin or whoever died. Well, I do feel bad for Peter, but I hope that won't happen anything with my mother again, hopefully. So, yeah. Well, you guys should all get your hero costumes on before it's too late because it's like four, no, not even four. It's like seven thirty, seven thirty, and you guys should get your hero costumes on. So hurry up and get your guys' hero costumes on. And yeah, because it's getting late for you guys. So get your hero costumes on, guys. Uh, yeah, guys, guys, we should get our hero costumes on before it's too late. Like, I have to be on by nine, from what I had, what my parents told me, and so the Jacob. So let's get our hero costumes on. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, we should really get our heroes, hero costumes on. So, yeah, let's do that. Well, uh, Dr. Thunderlight, the costume is a bit tight. Well, you can let them know after having the costume for about a month, at least, because I know that for a fact, so, yeah. What is even that knocking from the door from? I don't know, but I am gonna go shut the door if you don't mind. So let me go open the door. Uh, hello?